Had some ups and downs uh, this season, but uh, uh, to get that victory on Saturday, what, what does that do for you guys uh, heading back out uh, on the road this week? It definitely gives us a little bit of energy just getting kind of pumped that we won that game. It was a big win for us. We really needed that. And then as we hit the road here, it's going to be important for us to keep that same kind of energy so that we can win both games against Sonoma and San Francisco. You know, facing teams for now the second time this season, do you, um, is it kind of a, a different approach, especially with the, well, the teams that you, I mean, you have wins against uh, San Francisco and Sonoma, but you, you know about them, they know about you, but mm -hmm. is it kind of a, a different approach or kind of, I mean, what worked the first time will hopefully work the second time? Um, we've grown a lot since then and we've become better, so it is going to be different in that I think we're just going to all over, I mean, both teams, both teams have grown, played a lot of different games since then, and so uh, it's a lot of the same stuff, a lot of the same type of personnel, but it's it's going to be a different game. we got to work just as hard as we did against San Bernardino to get out there and get after it. Uh, well, many times when you guys play the Thursday, Saturday this weekend, the, the Friday, uh, Saturday, um, back to back, kind of mm -hmm. wear and tear of the you know, Friday and having to play again on a, on a Saturday. Um, does that make it more difficult? Or maybe it's just, I know in high school, I mean, there's tournaments you guys play three right. but at the college, it obviously takes a lot more out of you, but mm -hmm. uh, it is that difficult going back to back? I mean, going back to back is difficult, but I almost don't even notice it as much when we're on the road, because you're just like, yeah, let's get out there. That's what we're here. We're, we drove all this way to play basketball. Let's do it. And so, you just keep that kind of energy from first game to second game, and it's it shouldn't be a problem. How long does it take to feel comfortable in, in another gym, especially in a gym that say a player hasn't played in before? I know sometimes you kind of get you know players they get familiar with the rim and kind of the yeah. bounce and that kind of thing. But uh, how long does it take to kind of get comfortable with another court? Uh, it shouldn't. Hopefully, it doesn't take very long. You know, you got to play in it. So you go up, you get some shots in, maybe the night before, and. Uh, hopefully the night before and then some shots in that next morning and it should be enough a basketball court is basketball court and bounciness of the rim you know make your shots get it in and win talking with coach this season uh, there's been games where you guys just couldn't hit the shot or just kind of mm -hmm. you know getting open for that shot and just maybe making bad decisions you guys feel like hopefully that you know that's behind you i mean when you when the ball's going in i mean it's it's, it's a rhythm and it's had a good Feel like kind of you guys have you know worked hard to kind of get you know more open looks. I think we've worked really hard and we continue to work hard. And I think it worked well for us in the last game to get open and we were making shots and that was great. We got five people in double digits and it was it was an awesome game for us. And so I think that we're all. I mean that's always going to be something you have to overcome is getting the ball in the hoop. And so we've done a better job at that and hopefully we can continue to do that so we can win.